Good evening, Dennis. Hello, good evening, sir. Hello, how's it going? How are you? Just fine. Waiting for. Okay, hope that you are okay also. Sorry? I hope that you are okay. Ah, okay, yeah. Hello, Gisela. Welcome. Good evening. Good evening. How are you doing? Just fine? Are you ready to start with the class tonight? <laughs> yeah, you are, you are more than ready, right? Hey, do you like coffee? Hello, Juan. Juan Antonio, good evening. Yes, I like it, coffee. Uh, you like coffee, Dennis? I'm going to start to prepare my coffee. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, good evening, people. I have Dennis, Juan Antonio. Okay. Say hello, Juan Antonio, to people. Hello. Hope you are having a great time. Hello, Marco. How are you doing, Marco? I'm doing well, and you? It's fine. Hey, ready to start with a new a with a new class? Yes, I'm ready. Fantastic. Hope you did your homework. Oh uh, yes, yes, of course. Uh, of course, that's the way it is. I really like that. Okay, I have also Nelson. Nelson, enjoy your meal, Nelson. I can see that you're having your, you. your dinner now. <laughs> what, what are you eating? Some pizza or some pupusa? No, no teacher, it's Coca Cola. Some Coca Cola with some snacks. Y galleta. <laughs> <laughs> and some cookies. Okay, very good, Nelson. Okay, uh, well, I'm really happy to see you. And we're going to start in a couple of minutes. Now, we're going to start talking about Humber assignment, okay? Uh, yesterday, you were in church of talking about um, describing someone you admire, right? You are in church of talking during one minute, two minutes, the time you did, you decided to participate, it's all right, okay? And I think everybody will participate tonight. Hello, Claudia. Miss Al Mrs. Salgado. Good evening, teacher. Solo voy a estar de oyente, teacher. Ah, okay. 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 Ada. Hello, Ada. Hello. Good night. Good evening. Good evening, Ada. Okay. So do me the favor to activate your camera, please. Ada, do me the favor. Now, if you are facing problems with the camera, just let me know it, all right? Okay, people, now let's get down to business. Uh, tonight, we're going to talk about um, people we admire, right? You know, I will start talking about my, my mother. You know, uh, I think she's the most beautiful woman in the world. She is a very hardworking a woman, and she's short, she's short, and he has gray hair because she's 60 years old now. Uh, but anyways, I love her a lot. Okay, with all my heart. I started with, with I mean, with the description of the person I admire. Now, everybody will do will do it, okay? So, let me see. Uh, Gisela, let's start with you, please. What can you tell us about that person you admire? Perdón, ¿qué dijo? Uh, can you tell us about uh, the description of the person you admire? Ah, la descripción de la persona yeah. que miraba. Exactly. Permítame. Mi, Mr. Navarrete. He was my math teacher in high school. He stopped thing. Middle age, 
and black hair with a beard and so friendly. I made him because he is very dedicated to his work and knows how to deal with students with, without having to argue with them and raise his voice to voice to demonstrate his authority. Mr. Navarrete is a good teacher. Wow, I, I think he's a good teacher, okay? Oh, oh, thank you very much, Isela. That was fantastic. Now, listen, I will, uh, before I continue uh, with the activity, I will, I will let you know about this, okay? I will challenge you to um, provide a description about, a, uh, about the same person if you want, or if you want to talk about another person, but try to do it, I mean, uh, without reading. Without reading, and also by, um, let us try to do it faster, okay? Let, let us see, I saw a person who wanted to participate, but that was really good, he said, like, great information about your teacher, congrats. Uh, Xiomara, I think Xiomara says, okay, Xiomara, we'll take it into consideration. Okay, let's continue with Marco then. Marco, go ahead with your homework, please. Okay, okay, okay. Okay. My mother is middle age. She's fairly short. She has a straight black hair. Sometimes she's a little angry, but she's often nice and friendly. And I admire her because every time she can help someone, she does. Great. Great info. All right, thank you very much. Nelson, go ahead. Teacher, I go to describe to my mom. Uh, my mom um, is, a, is a beautiful, is beautiful. Um, he has, a, she has, sorry, she has uh, a black hair. Uh, her, her eyes are uh, brown. And uh, she is short. Uh, she has 40, 45 years old. I think I don't remember exactly. Uh, uh, sometimes uh, she is very angry, uh, but but she she is lovely. Uh, so as a teacher. <laughs> Wow, that was enough, right? That was, en that, that was enough. Uh, I mean, and, and and also I can see that you really love your mom. And now let, let me try to correct some some um some mistakes. Okay, Nelson. Uh, okay, now pronunciation. She or she? She, uh, chi. We have two pronunciations there, right? Chi, she. Ah, uh, okay. So you, you, you gotta be careful, no, no, no. okay? She, she. She. Yeah, that, that's right. She. Yeah. She is very beautiful. She is, um, Ah, and there is something else that I want you to take into consideration. You know, we have the verb uh, have, but you know, I have a mouse, I have a, a computer, I have a one dollar, I have etc. Right? So that's about something, something you have. But when we talk about the age, you say she is, she is forty five. Uh... She is 45. How old are you, Nelson? How old are you? I am. Yeah. I am. How, yeah. How old are you? 
I am uh, 27. Hey, how old is your mother? Uh, she is. As I said, she is? <laughs> She's 45. Ah, uh, she's 45. Now, that's better. Thank you very much, Nelson. You learned something new tonight. What about Moses? Moses, want to share the information you got? Uh, All right. I will describe uh, who for me is the GOAT. Uh, tonight, I will describe Lionel Messi. Uh, Leo, Leo. Lionel Messi. Uh, All right. He's, he's fairly short uh, with short black hair. Uh, most of the time, he's wearing a football t-shirt. Uh, he's one meter 70. Uh, he's about uh, 35 and he's very intelligent and a uh, and, uh, humble person. Uh, do you think he's humble? Yes, uh, humble. He's humble. All right. Hey, great info. Hey, question, Mose. Do you think Argentina is going to be, are going to be the winners? Argentinian people? Um, Eh, ojalá. <laughs> <laughs> I hope so. You say I hope I so. Oh, right? it's a... okay. <laughs> I hope so. All right. Very good. Thanks. Uh, thanks for sharing uh, that information. That was really good. What about Juan Antonio? Juan Antonio, do you have something else for, for everybody here? Mm, my homework. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to talk about my grandpa. He's 75 years old. Sometimes he's, he's very angry, when, but I like to talk with him. He is bald. Uh, uh, he's gray, uh, dark eyes. Sometimes he's very bad tempered, but it's okay. Uh, okay, very good, Juan Antonio. Excellent info. Sometimes he is angry, but you know, I think everybody's angry, and 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 uh, I mean, sometimes it all depends on the situation, right? But we need to learn how to control ourselves. Denise, hello, hello, and I started. Yeah, please go ahead. Okay, I'm going to talk Steve Aoki. He is tall, he is thin, he has a long. Uh, I'm sorry. Don't worry. And he has a long black hair and he has a lot of tattoo. And he is from Tokyo but living in the USA. It is DJ and a super DJ and famous DJ in the music electronic. And he living with your mother. And with, with my mother? No, his mother. Oh, uh, okay, all right, very good. Yes, and he is a superstar in the electronic music, and I love his music. And you love his music. Okay, finish. All right, fantastic, Dennis. Great info. Maria Elena. Hi. Hi, Maria Elena. You wanna share the info you got? I speak my father. Okay. Um, he has green eyes. It is chain color. Um, he has light blonde hair. Light blue hair. Yeah. Okay. He is seventy odd years. Seventy. Oh, so seventy um, years old. Seventy old years. Years old. Okay, Maria Elena. I admire my father because it is um, very intelligent, brain, I mean, of faith. He never gives up. Is my example to follow. 
Wow. He's your role model. He is your role model to follow. Okay, he's brilliant and he never gives up. That's what I really like about, about the description you you told us tonight. Excellent info. Okay, Oscar Antonio. Uh, no, no, no tengo todavía la historia. Uh, you're still working on it. All right. Whenever you get ready, let me know it. Jocelyn okay. Elizabeth. Uh, you are ready. Claro, cuando tú estés. Good evening, yeah. Jocelyn. Uh, I will talk about Linda Perry. She is a singer writer and musical producer. She is a middle age. She is 67 years old. Her height is 160. She has a uh, long brown and curly hair. She has tan skin and, and dark brown age. She is a person strong and feisty and her history is intense and sad. I chose her because I like her voice and her love for revolution. I admire her because in 1993, when she was 25 years old, she wrote a song yes. in which she said that she didn't right. like the war and she lived and she cried and prayed every day for a revolution in this world. This song is WhatsApp by the rock band Forn and Blanc. This is all. Wow, lots of info. Lots of info and, and quite good information. Okay, I can see that you were like practicing the information that you investigated about the person and that you were practicing pronunciation also. Congratulations. Okay, I have Christian. Well, Christian seems to have some problems. Claudia? Do you feel better now, Claudia? Yesterday you were sick, right? I hope that you that you George are okay I... today. This time. Esmeralda. Well, let us try to continue then. I wonder if there's another person who wants to participate. Is there anybody, if you want to participate, if you haven't participated, do the favor to raise your hand and let's continue. Otherwise, we're gonna move on with the class for tonight, okay? Oscar, did you, did you finally get ready? Not yet? Not, not yet. So maybe maybe later. Okay. So let's see, people. Let us try to move on. Okay. Now, yesterday we were talking about how to describe people, and we were like um, practicing some uh, pronunciation. Okay. And we were just seeing the the video about about these two people. Okay. Give me one second, please. Do you remember about the about the situation in this conversation, people? What happened in the conversation? What's the situation in the conversation? Two friends told to boyfriends and uh, describe the person. Okay, there are two people talking about the description of a person, okay? Specifically about 
a new girlfriend, right? This lady is his new girlfriend. Okay, that's what we were studying yesterday. And also we were practicing the conversation, but tonight we're gonna move on and we're going to continue, okay? Now, uh, the lesson for tonight is about describing uh, and uh, asking and um, answering questions about appearance. Okay, so we will continue with it. And we're going to see, I mean, we saw this video, right? We saw this video also. Uh, we're gonna see it a second time so that we can remember about what we started yesterday. And then we're going to try to solve an activity that I share in WhatsApp. Let me know if With you red are, hair. Let me know if you are able to listen to it. Do you listen to it clearly? Yes. Yeah, okay. We're gonna listen, we're gonna see it only once. Then we're gonna try to work in an activity that I share through WhatsApp. She's gorgeous. Does he wear glasses? Yes, and he has a beard. Age. How old is she? She's about 32. She's in her 30s. How old is he? He's in his 20s. Height. How tall is she? She's 1 meter 88. She's 6 feet 2. How tall is he? He's quite short. Hair. How long is her hair? It's medium length. What color is his hair? It's dark brown. It's light brown. He has brown hair. When you want to know how someone is physically, we use what look like. For age-related questions, we use how old. For height, we use how tall. The rest of the question will depend on who you're talking about. All right, so that's what we started yesterday. And we will continue studying about it tonight. Okay, now I wonder if you could see the information I, sh I share in the WhatsApp group. Yes. Yes, what, what is the information you got there? Actually, I shared a, an exercise about describing people. That was a listening, all right? Later, uh, I share uh, uh, another link about a video to describe people, okay? To describe people. And the last one, which is the one that I'm, um, I want you to be working on tonight, is about um, um, filling the blanks conversation, okay? What does she look like got filled conversation? And I told you to download the file, the, the Word um, document, so that you can complete the conversation with it. So I, I, I don't know if you could do it. Did you download the, the file? Did you download the, the, the Word document? Because uh, you, you're going to start working on it now. No sé si lograron eh, descargar el, el documento de Word que compartí en WhatsApp. Yeah. No, teacher. Ok, si no, lo ha, si no lo han hecho, yes. háganlo por favor en este momento y empiezan a trabajar sobre el mismo. ¿Qué es lo que van a hacer ahí? Van a completar la conversación. Ok. Luego uh, la van a practicar en parejas. Y por último, van a crear una, una conversación propia. Yo voy a hacer los grupos acá. Ok. Let me see. Para que trabajen en parejas. Ok.
Okay, let us work in couples. Okay, got Okay, Marco and Maria. Van a trabajar en esa en esa conversación, por favor. Les voy a dar que alrededor de, de 15 minutos para que logren eh, completarlo, okay? Teacher. Tell me. Eh, yo no pude descargar el archivo. Y eh, what about Marco? Yes. Ah. Okay, so Marco has it, okay? Guys, hello, Ada, hello, uh, Dennis. Hello, good evening, teacher. Okay, I hope that you are working in the activity now. Okay, you will have 15 minutes to complete the conversation and at the end you are going to share it, okay? Okay. Okay, very good, thank you. No sé si logra ver ahí este, el documento, Adam. Sí. Pero fíjese que me lo da desordenado. Es esto. Aquí es donde tengo el detalle yo con esto. No sé si, si, si me dice cuál es su número en el grupo y se lo envío. Tal vez de ahí ya. Ok, Juan Antonio en Moses. No questions. Pues no lo entendemos mucho. Uh, okay. Este, en el WhatsApp yo compartí un documento de Word, okay, y compartí el enlace de la conversación. Okay, entonces lo único que tienen que hacer ustedes es completar esa conversación, practicarla y decirnosla. Okay. Ah, con, con el audio. Sí, con el audio. Ah, okay. Nosotros pensamos que era acerca de ordenarla. Palabras. No, es, esa es la segunda parte. Ok, comencemos primero con el ejercicio de la conversación. Bye. Ok, very good, thank you. Hello, Dennis. Ada? No, no questions about the activity? Uh, solamente que nos aparece como este, distorsionadas las letras acá arriba, teacher. Ah, no. Este, váyanse a la segunda parte, que es la de completar. Que sería acá. Ajá, la, las, lo último, correcto. No, ese es para crear la conversación. Eh, lo otro es para completar esa. Ok, esa es, entonces esa es para aquí completar. completamos las palabras que hacen falta, ¿verdad? Correcto, con, la, con el video que les compartí. Ah, ok. Y ya luego al final, pues lo practican, al final lo comparten con los demás. ¿Cuánto tiempo tenemos? Pues tienen 15 minutos. No todos van a participar, solo van a ser voluntarios, pero espero que ustedes sean uno, uno de esos. Thank you. Ok. Ok, Ada, entonces este, empezamos con, esto sí lo puede leer, vea, lo último de abajo. Sí, no, es G y Emma. Uh, ajá, de, 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 en donde es no, no y Emma. De, de eso. No, le está. Hello, Oscar, hello, Claudia, ¿tienen alguna duda? Uh, solo... 
que vamos a completar la oración. Van a completar la conversación. Ah, ah, las conversaciones. Con este desorden de palabras que tiene aquí, teacher. No, es la segunda parte. Eso, eso, el, ah, lo, que, eso no, esto no. lo que está arriba, sí, sí. lo que está arriba es para que ustedes creen una conversación. Ah, lo que está de... abajo es para que ustedes completen con el enlace del video que les compartí. Ah, ah, ya. Uh, ok. Es que piensa con Hey Emma and Calvin, my friends. Exactly. Ok. No se Muy preocupen bien. si no lo logran completar bueno, ahora, Brenda, porque pues igual les va a quedar de tarea, pero sí necesito que empiecen a, a practicar pronunciación. Ok. Ah, oh, va. Wow. Ok. De pronunciación, no se me queda. El niño es que no tiene un. Ah, hay que, hay que, hay que practicarlo muchas veces, ¿ok? Y mire, lo practico y lo practico y no se me quedan. Entonces, ah. se me está Pero, no, pero mientras más practiquemos, mejor. Porque, este, la práctica hacia el maestro. Excelente, así es, Ticha. Tiene okay. mucha razón. Entonces, okay. sí, tengo que seguir practicando. Y al otro así lo visitan. Lo Con visitan. permiso. Con bueno, está bien. Bueno, entonces, continuamos. Hello, Gisela. Hello, Xiomara. Hello, teacher. Do you have any question Hello. about the activity? Estamos, ¿cómo se llama? Completando. Completando el, el documento. El, con el oh. diálogo que nos dijo que teníamos que crear. Excellent. Very good. Excellent. So, Solo teníamos que completarlo y crear un diálogo o hay otra cosa que no me acuerdo. Fíjense que por cuestión de tiempo no, no creo que logremos hacer ambas actividades, ¿verdad? Pero sí les va a quedar de tarea. Lo que solicito por el momento es que completen la conversación. ¿Y el diálogo queda de tarea? ¿El que vamos a crear? Sí, va a quedar de tarea. ¿Ok? Ok. Ok. Entonces me regalas un número de Xiomara para escribirle. Muy bien. Sí, está bien. Ajá. Me faltaba más de completante. Hello, Nelson. Hi, teacher. Estoy llenando eh, solito el documento. Perfecto, Nelson. Complételo, por favor. Algunos no, se, no lograron ingresar a la sala, no entiendo por qué. Pero, sí. anyways, trabaje, trabaje la actividad. No sé si tiene alguna pregunta. Ah, pues, hasta el momento, creo que no, teacher. Estaban un poco como desordenadas las, eh, las palabras, así como tiradas al azar. Okay, One, like, how no, listen, Nelson, eh, lo que yo estoy solicitando es la conversación que está abajo. Okay. La que está abajo, que es de completar. Ya luego, este, eh, ya cuando terminen eso, pueden crear una conversación propia, ¿ok? Ok. Ok. Ya sería imaginaria, Tish. <risas> sí, claro. <risas> Ey, pero... Lo felicito porque está muy activo en la clase y está participando mucho, está aprendiendo, ¿ok? Thank you, teacher. Ok. Le voy a asignar, quiero ver.
Hello, teacher. Hello, hello. Teacher, Hello. Eh, en mi sala me tocó con, con Jonel, pero me dice que ella no podía eh, en este momento. Uh, ok, me yo sí. Pasando la... Ok. Por eso la incluí con... Ah, sí, no me había fijado. Sí, con Nelson. Trabaje con Nelson, okay. por favor. Ok, teacher. Eh, si me hace el favor de explicarme de nuevo, solo, solo le escuché que íbamos a, a practicar la conversación del documento. En, en el documento está una, conversa, una conversación incompleta. Yo uh -huh. les compartí un video en el, en el grupo de WhatsApp y hay que completar esa conversación con lo que ustedes escuchan ahí. Uh -huh. Y ya luego decirnoslo en, en, en la sala general. Ok, teacher. Ok. Gracias, teacher. Ok. Vamos a invertir unos siete minutos más y luego vemos si hay algunos que ya lo completaron. Si no lo logran completar, no se preocupen porque vamos a seguir con esto pues mañana, ¿ok? Ok, teacher, thank you. Ok. Hello, Nelson. Ay, yo soy ¿Tiene el documento? Eh, sí, ya lo tengo. Ah, ok. ¿Por dónde iba? No sé por si dónde ya lo puedo leer. No, Hola. pues yo ahorita yo ya, lo, yo ya lo estaba leyendo. ¿Sí? Ajá. Ya casi estaba. ¿Qué es Chor? Compañera. Quiero ver, quiero ver. Sí, podría hacer eso. Sí, short. 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 Y luego Emma pregunta: ¿Anything also is here? Eh, sorry to interrupt. Lo siento si les interrumpo. Por acá incluía la señorita Jonel para que se pueda integrar a la actividad. Ok. Ok. Bye. Vaya. Entonces, sí, eso podría. ¿Cómo dijo que fue? ¿Qué era la respuesta eh, de la tercera? Sí, es short. Es una, esa es una respuesta corta, porque luego viene, viene Emma y le pregunta: ¿Anything also is hair? O sea, que le dé más descripción de los ojos, el cabello. Entonces, y ahí luego en la otra, eh, sería ya la quinta, no a. Dice, eh, her es, eh, aquí pongámosle un color, es brown. Sí, pongámosle her eyes brown. Or brown. Or brown. She has, she has um, long hair, pongámosle. Black she has long hair. Si long... quieren le ponemos black long hair. Así, ah, black long hair. Black long hair. Um, ¿Qué dice? Her face is very beautiful. Her face is beautiful. It's very beautiful. Eh, luego ok, crear una conversación entre sí. ya está un trabajo grupal mande es un trabajo grupal sí, 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 sí eh, lo único que era un, traba, un trabajo en pareja, no sé si tú ya estabas eh, eh, con otra persona trabajando anteriormente. Que... Trabajando? ¿Cómo? Se me, se me cerró la aplicación de Zoom. Cuando se me cerró, estaba el profesor Iker, pero cuando se estableció la conexión, no podía entrar. Me decía que 
el anfitrión había creado salas de grupos pequeños, algo así. Ah, Entonces, bueno, pero, pero si gustas trabajar con nosotros vaya, sí. para, para que terminemos la, 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 la actividad. Vaya, ¿qué vamos a hacer? Vaya, ahorita yo ya terminé de, de rellenar este, lo, que, lo que hacía falta de la actividad. Entonces, ahorita solamente tenemos que crear una conversación. Ok. Este... Yo voy a cortar lo, lo, lo demás. Vaya, si no, voy a ver si puedo mandarte una captura, para, o sea, con toda la conversación para que la tenga. Vaya, si podés, porque yo igual. Vaya, solo la termino de pasar. Solo la termino de pasar entonces, porque me falta la de la 10 para abajo pasarla al documento. donde Porque lo escribí en el papelito. Ay, un solo solo, ¿eh? escuchar. Ajá. Hola. Si, si quiere, lo, lo, yo logro escuchar lo que usted puso. Si ah, quiere, lo okay. vamos complementando de una vez. Uh -huh. Vale, de acuerdo. Veamos entonces. She's thin and tall. She's y al principio siempre dice que él está buscando. Ajá, sí, lo mismo dice. I can, I can find. Sí. Ya no van a sacar aquí. Sí, ya no están sacando. Bueno, pero aquí no lo veo yo. ¿Aló? ¿No? ¿Ah? no lo miro, le. <ríe> Ahí está Bronze, sería el bar. Sí. Ahora la sexta es Do you wrong? What? Le dice, ¿verdad? Vamos sí. a ver. Pero no nos saquen. Ya sale como una sus cosas. Vamos sí. a ver. Fine, fine, fine. No. Don't worry. Mm -hmm. What is she? She's thin and tall. Anything else? Eyes? Her eyes are brown. She has long. ¿En qué se quedó? Uh, she has long, pink, curly hair. Is hair or hair? Hair. 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 Eight white sporty shoes. Anuncia el ocho. Le quitamos los números. No hay, no hay. Estaba. Es que quiero ver si es el ocho. No, así para, para ubicarnos mejor. Va. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok. Or try to help you. Fine hair. Thank you so much. She is very friendly and has a nice smile. Oh, look, it's the, is that girl across the street your friend? Wow. Uh -huh. Sí, ve, ahí voy. Ay, no, sería pronunciarlo los dos. Thank you. And, <clears throat> and I am very tall and I have a brown eyes and I have um, a black hair. Voy a para dar el paso. Si ya saben, intervención, digamos, para dar el paso 
de Ana, supongamos que Ana se llama la compañera. Sí, va. Ah, va, ah, va. Sí, sí. Ah, va. Para darle el paso, digamos que ustedes estaban juntos, digamos, entonces, como que intervendría y decía, how about your, your friend, ¿verdad? How about your friend, yes. Ajá. Vaya, y ahí hacía, ¿qué se presenta ella, verdad? Ajá, solo que, este, fíjate de que, este, digamos que la pregunta sería de vos para mí, porque vos me dirías, este... How about ah, sí, with sí, your sí. friend? Ah, Entonces, sí, como sí, ella sí. ya se describió, yo solo voy a leer la descripción que ella me dio. Ajá, no sé si, sí. si me entendés. Hey, how about your friend? Ah, yo, 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 yo te digo, my friend Ara is a working in the caja de crédito. He's a cashier and, I, and he have uh, 42 years and have uh, two dogs and have and has a brown eyes in a uh, long hair. Algo así sería, ¿verdad? Sí. Si quieres, dejémoslo hasta ahí porque ya casi vamos a salir de clase y no todos vamos a participar. Ah, cierto. Y ese tiempo que está corriendo ahí, te dice restante, siete minutos, diez segundos, nueve, ocho. Eso es lo que va a terminar la sala ahorita y después, y, o sea, ahorita tenemos que practicar esto por si nos toca participar. Ah, ya. Ajá. Okay. Eh, pero entonces después tengo que describirme yo, ¿verdad? ¿no? ¿Mande? Después yo me tengo que describir también. Ajá, creería yo que sí. Ok. Entonces, vaya, la estructura sería así. Yo me presento. Ajá. Luego tú te presentas. Luego tú me preguntas, ¿How about with your friend? Entonces, este, yo te describo a Ada. Entonces, uh -huh. luego de, de, de yo responderte por Ada, entonces a Ada le, le tendrías que preguntar en todo caso, ¿Ara va with your friend? Y Ada me podría de, 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 describir a mí. Uh -huh. ah, okay. Para que participemos los tres. Bueno, digamos que, que podemos suponer que eh, como vamos a participar los tres y tenemos que describirnos, supongamos que estábamos en un tipo de conversación de... Hay un montón de aplicaciones de esas donde se conoce gente nueva. ¿Ah? Entonces podemos dar esta introducción de que nosotros eh, estamos como en uso de una aplicación de esa, pero no nos podemos ver, digamos, ¿verdad? O, o sí, no sé. Eh, pero como tenemos que describirnos, o sea, para la razón de que nos vamos a describir, sería no, como que no nos estamos conociendo personalmente, sino que a través de un medio electrónico, digamos. Ah, va, Entonces, perfecto. Ahí donde, ajá, ahí es donde ya vienen la, las preguntas de cómo que, que, que se escriban. Perfecto. Escriba, como, pues, ajá. Sí, va. Ok. Ok, empie entonces empiezo yo. Voy. Um, hello, my name is Dennis and I'm working the hotel in the beach. Nice to meet you. Okay, people, how was it? How was it? How was the activity? Was it difficult? It's a little difficult. A little bit difficult. Don't worry, okay? Because you are going to have more time. Okay? That was like my, my, my first... Uh, activity working with you like like this okay uh, i just want to know uh, how well can you work in pairs in groups and this is this was my my first experience okay hope you have um, taken advantage of it and uh, we're going to see what's going on with the activity who finished who finished
Who finished with the activity? How was the activity? Was it difficult? Was a little bit easy? Did you need some more time? Difficult. Very difficult. And I have an idea and I work in the other class. Uh, yeah, that's or, right. Or... I mean, you are going to have uh, tomorrow to finish the but, activity. Uh, the activity needed more time. Yeah, I mean, that's why I I, I um, ask you to work in person just to fill in the blanks, okay? To fill in the blanks, and if you had more time to practice it, it will be all right. But if you couldn't do so, don't worry, because you have the document, you have the video, and you have all the tools to keep working tomorrow, okay? So I, I will switch a little bit into Spanish so that I can check the list of tendons and see if I have committed some mistakes uh, with it. Es, ya vamos a hablar de la actividad, solo voy a pasar la lista, ok, por si acaso me he equivocado acá con algunos, eh, eh, Esmeralda e Isabel. Ricardo, no sé si logró entrar al final. Sonia Rebeca. Stephanie Michelle. Víctor Alfred. Ok. Bueno, ¿cómo estuvo la actividad? Algunos dicen difícil. Saben que me metí a las diferentes salas y los vi que estuvieron trabajando muy bien. Estuvieron muy concentrados en la actividad. Y este, la verdad que yo, yo sé que la actividad requería un poquito más de tiempo. Especialmente en la, en la segunda parte, en donde yo les pedía que crearan una conversación, porque crear no es tan fácil como solo completar una conversación. Entonces, no sé si alguien logró completar la conversación. No, teacher. No. Ok, si no pudieron, no se preocupen, porque ahí tienen el video, tienen el documento, y si no, logra, no lo logramos esta noche, pues lo vamos a lograr eh, mañana. Eh, prepárense con eso, ok, eh, completar la conversación y si pues no logran coordinar tiempos, no se preocupen. Yo entiendo que aquí hay personas que trabajan todo el día y que además de eso, pues se reúnen en las noches a aprender un segundo idioma. Wow, la verdad que son, son de admirar, son personas que admirables. Entonces, si no logran coordinar eh, los tiempos en el día, pues no se preocupen, hagan, hagan lo de fill in the plans, lo de completar los espacios, que con eso yo voy a estar satisfecho. Pero si ustedes logran crear una conversación, pues eso es como dar la, la milla extra. Y este, pues también es válido. Entonces mañana vamos a trabajar, vamos a terminar eso, vamos a empezar con eso. Ok, el día de mañana. No sé si hay preguntas. No questions, algunos comentarios, cómo les fue con la actividad. Eh, yo solo tengo una duda, eh, en la parte, quiero ver, creo que en la parte 9, yo escucho que dice I'll, pero no sé si ese es como I will. Ok, eh, let me see, quiero ver si lo encuentro acá. Espérenme un momentito. Eh, well, depende del contexto, Moses. I, si la persona dice, I will, entonces tiene que coincidir con la idea en general. Es que no, no encontré el documento, aquí no lo tengo a la mano. Pero de igual manera, este, lo vamos, a, lo vamos a, a visualizar todos mañana, ¿ok? Lo vamos a visualizar. Eh, hagan lo mejor que puedan, que de igual manera lo vamos, a, lo vamos a visualizar mañana, ya completo. ¿Ok? Ok. Ok. ¿Is there any other question? 
Si no hay más preguntas, comentarios, pues entonces nos vemos mañana, chicos. Recuérdense, vamos a iniciar con la conversación, ¿ok? Mañana iniciamos con conversación. Ok, teacher, good night. Ok, good night. Ahora no se conoce. Thank you, teacher. Okay, good night. See you Thank tomorrow. you, teacher. Good night. Good night. Good night. See you later. Good see night. You, see you tomorrow.